Hey guys, Rob to the Third Bad Poncho Outdoors. Today we are looking at setting up our ice fishing bucket. We're going to begin by using PVC pipe. This is one quarter inch PVC pipe. I threw it in a miter box to kind of help me keep my lines a little straight. I'm using a, a standard hacksaw for this. Um, we're going to begin by cutting it into six inch pieces. Um, once that is done, we're going to use the piece that we cut as our um, outline piece. So we're going to just use that to make the notches for the other pieces. Once we have enough pieces for all the rods we have, I have five rods, so I have five pieces of PVC. I throw them back in the miter box and do a 45 degree cut on the end. That just helps to make sure the rod kind of stays a little more secured and it looks a heck of a lot better. Uh, once that's completed, it'll be really jagged and kind of melted if you run through it really quickly. So hitting it with a piece of sandpaper, um, starting you know, pretty low grit and heading up higher and higher uh, will help you to get nice and smooth. Uh, really, it's, it's personal preference, so you don't have to do this. It just makes it look a little bit better. I'm running a pilot hole. It depends on the type of screws you're using. I used a bolt for this just because my thought process is if I have bolts protruding into the middle of the bucket, I can then have my tip-ups, so I use round tip-ups um, on the top and my fish below that. Um, really, but that's it, guys. Pretty simple thing to do. Um, took me maybe 15 minutes to do from start to finish for something that's now a customized ice bucket that would cost me in the neighborhood of 45-ish dollars in most retail stores for the bucket plus the caddy system. But I'm Robert to the third, Bad Poncho Outdoors. As always, thanks for watching, guys, and good luck on the water.